。嗨，大家好，今天我先生在家休息，借这个机会，我让他在这里解答一下。一个网友提出来的关于心理医学以及精神病医学方面的不同之处在哪里 ？So you asked me to talk about the difference between a psychologist and a psychiatrist. Both of them work in the field of mental health. Both of them help people who have mental disorders or mental illnesses or what some people might call a mental dysfunction. Okay. The The biggest difference is the route of the education. They go to two different kinds of education、mm -hmm. that focus on two different kinds of things.、Mm -hmm. So a psychiatrist is a physician, a medical doctor,、mm -hmm. who has specialized in the area of mental disorders.、Mm -hmm. So somebody who is a psychiatrist has gone to college, then went to medical school, like、mm -hmm. every other physician, whether it's a pediatrician or a cardiologist. Or a、uh, surgeon.、Mm -hmm. The psychiatrist has completed medical school, then went on to specialist training in psychiatry.、Mm -hmm. All the different specialties、mm -hmm. have their own different training,、mm -hmm. and they are all called a residency. So after medical school, a person goes to a residency in. Pediatrics, or surgery, or cardiology, or psychiatry, or lots of other medical fields.、Mm -hmm. The medical school in this country is always at least four years,、mm -hmm. and psychiatry residency in this country is almost always four years.、Mm -hmm. Different fields of medicine have different numbers of years of residency, but psychiatry is almost always four years. So a psychiatrist has completed college, four years of medical school,、mm -hmm. and four years of specialist training in psychiatry alone.、Mm -hmm. In that training, they're trained in all sorts of different mental conditions, and the treatments for all those mental conditions.、Mm -hmm. Many of those treatments involve medication, but not all of them. They're trained in all sorts of treatments.、Mm -hmm. And they they get an awful lot. They get a, a a tremendous amount of education in the medications used to treat those mental disorders.、Mm -hmm. Now, a psychologist goes a different route. They complete college and then they go into a graduate school for the study of psychology.、Mm -hmm. Most psychologists have to obtain a doctoral degree. They are a doctor of psychology. That's not a physician. It's just a doctoral degree、mm -hmm. in psychology, and that usually takes anywhere from four years to five years.、Mm -hmm. In a psychologist training, they don't just train about mental disorders. They learn an awful lot about how the brain operates during normal times when nothing is going wrong. They learn all kinds of things about memory and how we think, and what parts of the brains do what part of thinking, and how we interact with other people. All when things are going right. They also get training in mental disorders and the treatments for those mental disorders. They get a little bit of training in the medications, but not enough to be able to allow them to prescribe the medications, just to know what they are. And a psychologist gets a tremendous amount of training in the talk therapies, the kind that you see in movies or TV, where a psychologist or any other sort of therapist is sitting in the room one on one with a client, and they talk about what the client is having difficulties with in their life. Psychiatrists get some of that training, but not as much as a psychologist. Psychologists cannot prescribe medications for mental disorders, except in a few states, and they have to go beyond their usual psychology training to go get an additional one or two years of training to prescribe those medications. But that training is all about the medications specifically for mental disorders. They don't get training in all of the other twenty or thirty thousand medications. That somebody might be prescribed for other things, like high blood pressure or cancer,、uh, uh, or in.
infectious diseases. And so a psychiatrist is trained in all those different things and knows how to look for interactions between medications that the psychiatrist prescribes and all the other doctors in a patient's life might prescribe. Mm -hmm. There are other ways to become a therapist. A psychologist is just one of those. In every state, there are usually at least two or three other ways to become a therapist, and those usually involve a master's degree, a lower degree than a doctoral degree. A master's in social work, or a master's in marriage and family therapist, or a master's in licensed counseling, those vary from state to state. But there are lots of therapists out there with those master's degrees in those other related fields. That's it. I think that's enough. Thank you.